Being part of the safeguarding team, we work closely with our colleagues and partner agencies to reach the people who need our help and keep them safe, whoever they are. Together, we are one team. So when we use the term rescue, um, people will often think that we are rescued from a car crash or a fire. But actually the work that we do within the safeguarding team is just as valuable um, and we are rescuing people. The main objective is to make sure that people are safe and protected from risk of harm and abuse. Some of the key areas that we've been um, working with um, recently to support our customers um, are around child abuse, domestic abuse, um, modern slavery, human trafficking, self-neglect um, and hoarding. Making safeguarding personal is really important. It's about working really closely with the customer so that they understand the risks um, and also the support that can be put in place. We will then look to the most appropriate form of care. So that may be um, speaking to um, police in some situations, um, social services in others, uh, housing, uh, mental health teams, um, and also charities as well. We have a really good working relationship with our partner agencies. Nobody, no sole agency can tackle safeguarding on their own. We've all got different pieces of the puzzle to put together to make sure that that person is protected. There are times where a customer may, may disclose information and we can act on that straight away. So there was a case that I worked on that was raised to me by fire crews who'd gone out to an incident of a fire and the customer at the time disclosed that they were subjected from domestic abuse. Straight away, as soon as I heard the situation, I just wanted to help. We were able to work with one of our local um, partnership community safety units um, and the customer then went on to disclose a lot of years um, of where they had suffered from domestic abuse and the firefighter is one of the first people that they'd ever told. To know that we made that difference, that we identified and acted really quickly to, to protect somebody that was in a serious risk of harm makes this whole job worth it. That's why I'm here. People are safeguarded and they're no longer at risk of abuse and harm because of something that we have done and actions that we have taken as a service.